Hello world, Mr. Resistor here, continuing our alpha journey. And, uh, let's see. Do some manufacturing, because we're here. And I think maybe we'll go run a mission. Why not? Uh, all right. Been a long week. My brain's a bit fried. Oh, yeah. I should have a contract. Maybe I won't run a mission. All right, no. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I probably shouldn't do any combat. I'm clearly extremely stupid right now. All right. <clears throat> right, that's what I was short on. Okay. Is there anything I want to take with me?
active. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Drive active. Oh yeah, so, <clears throat> as I've mentioned before, uh, I am working on, or my day job is, uh, <clears throat> I'm a software engineer on the New World Turnip team. We, uh, today that uh, that our release candidate has been accepted by PlayStation um, hopefully Xbox will be soon behind drive active. which means uh, <laughs> I don't have mandatory play testing this weekend which is nice I do enjoy the game, but, you know, <laughs> games are always better when, uh, when they're on your own time. But, that's just how it is working in the industry sometimes. Uh, <clears throat> Docking position requested. Docking request accepted. Of course, I expect to still be a zombie tomorrow, as I will be playing chauffeur for a couple of friends of mine who are participating in a mountain bike race uh, which starts much earlier than I'm used to getting up so chances are I'll not be getting a ton of sleep tonight uh Let's see. Right, so how long is that going to be? Oh, not too bad. <coughs> Alright, well, one down, I guess. Am I. Eh, I should probably trust my gut and 
not get myself into any combat. I think I've magically become less dumb in the last five minutes. So we'll just go do some scanning. <clears throat> Warp drive active. So let's see, tomorrow we'll be, I guess, taking that to uh, heck to sell it. Maybe I'll <coughs> drive active. I guess I'll, I should probably check the price at HiSec buyback also, see if that might be the better way to go, but I mean, it was what, 600 and something million-esque in heck, so that seems worth the effort of selling it myself. Cool thing is that actually production costs were less than what was estimated. So if I remember correctly, estimate was like 220 something and uh, my actual costs are like 175. So with some luck, I'll be pulling in some decent money. another uh, EVE Online YouTuber that recommends it. I want to say Ace Face, but don't quote me on that. But he seems much more uh, much more serious about doing project discovery than I am. He probably does more mining than than I have been doing. Warp drive active. Oh yeah, another thing, uh, working in the game industry thing that happened today. Um, so a while back I, I, uh, participated in a, uh, playtest for Throne and Liberty, which, you know, decent game, uh, um, like with many of those sorts of games, I mean, I did, I did enjoy playing it and I don't have any like criticisms of it um, seemed seemed like fun um, I've seen some comments some places that it's that it either is or was pay to win um, I didn't see Docking permission request. I didn't Docking see indications of that when I was playing it but anyway because it was uh, internal because I think it's uh being published by Amazon. Um, they had uh, prizes for reaching certain milestones. I met all the milestones. 
Um, and then kind of forgot about it because it was a while ago. And then today, a random package shows up at my door. I'm like, what? Turned out it was all my prizes that I earned. Um, the very subtle coaster. The tumbler, which uh, seems pretty cool, but I need to straw for it. And, uh... Uh... Because it's like, you know, one of those screw-top ones that would... Would normally have us, like a rubber tube or something. I don't know. I don't know if those usually come with straws or not. I don't normally buy that kind of thing, but... And then a sweatshirt, which I think is in Korean sizes. And, uh... I am a big dude. So I ordered the 3X. Um... And I don't know how Korean sizes work. I know that in Japan, uh, sizes tend to be two sizes smaller than their American equivalent. So if I want a 3X in American sizes in Japan, that would be like a 5X. I suspect Korea is probably about the same. So anyway, I've got a Throne in Liberty sweatshirt that seems pretty high quality. I mean, I like I like the way it looks, but uh, it is too small for me. So, guess I'm looking for a home for it. Um. Anyway, that's going to be it for me for tonight, so until next time, have a good one.